Good morning everyone, I hope that you're okay. Welcome to my channel, my name's Leanne. I am about to show you a grocery haul from Aldi. Uh, yeah, so I'm just gonna get cracking. You might hear a uh, demented screaming noise. That will be my cat. She's one heck of a diva. I'm just gonna open the living room door because for some reason she's decided that she's too posh to jump through the hatch anymore. There you go, whenever you're ready, madame. Right. It was so busy in there. So, so busy. Just mental. That's her munching away now. So she's decided that she's had all morning to come out here, but she's decided that because I'm going to be picking up the camera, that she's gonna um, annoy me. Right, as usual, my lovelies, I will be popping all of the prices on the screen. I always do that, and I will always continue to do that because I like to know the prices of things. First up, I have a pack of four uh, spring water. We do not drink water from the tap. Just don't like it. We're in a very hard water area as well, so... Right, just get on with. I've got packed them in like some random sort of order. I've got some white bats. Um, I'm going to be doing a smash burger tonight. Picked up some tortilla wraps because one of the meals we I'll either do fajitas or just a chicken wrap. I picked up some of these um, metro rolls, so like sub rolls. These are the cheese and herb. They're really nice. Martin really likes those for lunch. And then I also picked up the seven grain version. I can eat those ones because they're not as they don't have as many seeds. And then I picked up a couple of loaves of the toasty bread. I'll pop one of those in the freezer. Um, I won't eat, I'm not gonna eat two loaves. So that is my receipt. So I'll need that to put all the prices up for you. Pop that down there. Right, what's in this bag? Okay, random, random, random. Okay, so I've got a bag of flour because I need to top up my container. Yorkies and things like that. I picked up another coffee. I have still got one of these. I'm really enjoying this one. Um, it's got another one still in the cupboard, but because they're, they're small and you can't get a bigger one, grab one when I can. I picked up a golden vegetable microwave rice. Um, these rices are great for Martin if there's a leftover, something meat, curry, or something like that, that he can just what, uh, take one of these and uh, add it to it. I picked up some white chocolate chip uh, cookies. They just sounded nice. I picked up a tin of coconut milk because I think I'm going to be doing a curry. That's what I wanted to check actually. Oh yeah, so the other day when I popped into Aldi or something, I can't remember what it was. It might've just been bread actually. Um, Bella, shh. Sorry, I picked up these um, Madras curry pots. So I just added a tin of the coconut milk. Bella, I'm on the, not on the phone. Oh, she makes me sound like a nutter. I'm doing my shopping haul. I grabbed a couple of boxes of paracetamol. Bella! The door's open! Do you wanna go out? If you don't want to go out, well, you go, you go in the living room then. She doesn't want to go out. She just wants to sit there and cry. Uh, I picked up some of these yoghurt and fruit, yoghurt, strawberry, fruit bars. 
don't really know why. I just <laughs> don't know. I picked up five of these, uh, the golden syrup oat pots, my new seeds for work. They don't often have them in um, nine times out of ten. They just have the plain ones or the apple ones, which he doesn't like. Let me pop them over there. I'm running out of space. It's because I still need to tidy up. Okay. This is so terrible. So for the past, I think, three... This is the third... This is the third third savoy cabbage that i picked up to do cold cannon i still haven't done this i don't understand why i just don't haven't been fancy in it but i'm going to do it this week so yeah i've got my savoy cabbage <laughs> uh, i picked up a bag of the uh, sweet uh, salad it's just nice to add into sandwiches or with the dinner cucumber I hope it's not too blurry or anything. Um, I picked up, oh, God, I'm really, oh gosh, really, really squished. Uh, baby leaf salad, just to add to that. Okay. Uh, vine ripened tomatoes. We have had these peppers, the yellow and green. Pack of those. Picked a bunch of bananas. Oh, I've just realised one of them split. I'm going to have to open that bag and get that out. Oh. Picked up a bag of the red onions to have with the salads. And then obviously the white onions or brown, what they're called, brown onions uh, for dinners, things like that. Picked up a bag of the Maris Piper potatoes. We also got a bag of uh, bacon potatoes. A bag of um, Nature's Pick British Carrots. And some British Baby Button mushrooms. I think we're on to the fridge stuff now. I did pick up something from the centre aisle, when I'll, so I'll show you that one in a minute. So I picked up some light uh, chocolate pots. They're chocolate and caramel, so they have um, another double layer. So just for a sweet treat, I picked up a pack of uh, these vanilla and raspberry yogurts because Mimi was over yesterday and we didn't have any yogurts. Well, I hadn't been chopping anyway, but we didn't have any any yogurts at all. No. Um, picked up some uh, Greek lemon yogurts. Just something to have rather than always eating chocolate or something like that. So I picked up the Aberdeen Angus uh, quarter pounder beef burgers. So I will um, smash these down so that they're, I don't like thick um, beef burgers. And I like them when they go a little bit charred on the uh, edges. So I just smash them down myself. I picked up a pack of wafer thin roast chicken for rolls, sandwiches, whatever have that with a bit of salad. I picked up a uh, mince beef for something. I'm, it's so versatile, I just pick it up and then it will be a dinner. This will do us two dinners because it's a huge pack of the um, chicken mini fillets. I picked up a, a cheesy garlic bread and margarita pizza because i had mine the other day i think martin had i hope he didn't have it actually i did get him a pizza but i don't think he ate it no he didn't it's still in there i picked up a nordpack 
Nord pack, yeah. Um, Otter picked up a rich and indulgent coleslaw. Somebody recommended, one of my lovely subscribers, you know who you are, uh, recommended the salt and pepper fries. So I'm going to have these with the burgers. I've also got some onion rings, so I'm just going to do like a little, a little yum yum yum. Picked up a four pinter of semi skim milk. And of course, uh, smooth, not from concentrate, orange juice. That is all the food items. And then, oh well, I, I did pick up a pack of cat food for Bella. I also picked up this um, food, uh, what do you call it? Container? Holder? So it's got a little handle, it's got a big. I'm really rubbish at showing you things like this, sorry. It's got a big hole there and it's got a a food scoop. So, yes, I picked that up. I think that was 6 99 which is about all right, isn't it? I just hate, yeah. And I feel like sometimes she could she could knock that over if she wanted to. You shut up. She's trying to get in all her carry bags now. This is what she does. She's absolutely cuckoo. So that is my shopping haul. So that came to a grand total of £63.40. Now considering I got the £6.99 thing, I think that's really good. When I go to Sainsbury's, it really adds up to a heck of a lot more than that. Um, are you all right, hon? Look, at it, look I got you. Oh no, she was just jumping in them all. Oh, she just got out. I was about to show you. Honestly, you wouldn't think she was an elderly old lady. <laughs> Cat. Um, yeah, that's. I think that's really reasonable. If I'd have gone to Sainsbury's, well, I did last week uh, before we went away. We popped in just to get some, literally a few top up items, and I spent forty one pounds in Aldi no problem went into Sainsbury's because I needed some toiletries um and some other bits and bobs and fair play we did buy a, a birthday present in there as well but it was like 75 pounds it's like doesn't or 71 pounds something like that anyhow now I've got the amazing task of putting this all away I hope that you guys are all okay and uh yeah I don't really have anything else to update you with. You're going to see a day in a life video uh, alongside this. Well, not alongside it. I'm filming it on the same day. So it feels a little bit weird because I feel like I'm not filling you in on stuff. But it's because I'm doing it in that video. I don't know which way around it's going to be. It might be that this is the first video that you see. And then my day in life follows. So I'll love and leave you there. Uh, I need you guys to know that you are so loved. If you're if you're struggling with anything at all, please reach out. Um, I'd love to pray for you. And yeah, you guys are loved. That's what I'm going to say. Your your life matters. You are worthy. You are unique. There's one of you. Don't let anyone put you down. Ever ever ever. You are so amazing. And um, you're here for a reason. There's a there's a purpose for your life. I will love and leave you there. I hope that you have an amazing week. Whatever you guys sorry whatever you guys are doing and i'll catch up with you really really soon lots and lots and lots of love guys and god bless and i think to myself and i'm thinking out loud we won't need nothing else for the rest of our time